Hello, greetings to you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hope you're doing well by the time you see this video. So today we are doing, oh, okay, is that what you want to talk about? Wait, let me shut, let me, let me set the intention first. Time this reading. I come with gratitude, love, and light, clearing out the old reading that I just did. We're doing a new reading based on intuition, figure out what we need to talk about, timeless reading for people watching other than myself. Okay, now we can go. So I hope you're doing well. Today we're doing a timeless daily reading, so it can be for whatever time of year, time of month that you need to hear this. Um, there's no specific day, but it is called a daily reading, just to keep, just, yeah, one per day. <laughs> So thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you're new. And if you're not, thank you for coming back. If you're looking for my Pick a Card Readings playlist, I did, I did, I did, I did um, organize them in my playlist. So check that out. I have many more, uh, yeah, 150 Pick a Card Readings in there. And this video will go in my daily readings playlist separate so you can keep everything organized. All right, so... I'm using the Cute and Creepy Tarot. I love this deck. Deck reviews on my channel already, I'm sure. Okay. Actually, I will be doing it soon, but by the time you see this, it will be already be on my channel. So what is the issue here? Four of Wands. Okay. What do we need to talk about? Four of Wands. Ooh, you coming together with someone. You celebrating getting married? Or you connecting uh, with someone and having a celebration, you uh, meeting your partner, your behalf, you, the sparks flying, love, 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 love is in the air. The love boats. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I shuffled and that is what came out. Ten of cups. Wow. Ten of cups, ten of cups, ten of cups. So, <laughs> oh my gosh. The four of wands. And then ending with the Ten of Cups. So this is your happy family. So in the traditional tarot, Four of Wands, two people celebrating, maybe getting married. Ten of Wands, you basically, this is the end result. You're getting married and having lots of children. you having everything you needed and wanted and more. Needed, wanted, and more. All right, so let's figure it out. So we're getting all lovey-dovey messages here. I'm feeling, I'm feeling. So, um... Let me pull my timeless reading. This is my Wally's World Oracle from the lovely Tara. Timeless reading. Okay. These two cards wanted to come out. Okay. So, Kittens, Weights, and Tarot. Tara. She has a tarot channel and lots of beautiful videos. I coll collaborate with her every month. If you want to check out our collaborations, we've done two. So far, we will be working on an 80s collaboration for pick card readings. So basically, um, yeah, this is her deck. So look, we have the Ten of Cups. Okay, you, yes, you have your happy family, you have your money, you have your happy home. Look, are these sea dragons or sea horses? Sea dragons, yeah, okay. Okay, V. Um, look, Wally's right here. So you, um... Let me look at this real quick. Hold on. Let me look. Let's look at this together, shall we? Let's look at this. What are, what are you getting? Mm -hmm. We have bamboo. We have a cat hiding behind the bamboo or standing right beside, beside the bamboo stalk. We have a patch of lavenders. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Okay, I'm going to come back to these. I need more information. I need more words. I need more words. I'm going to go with my Witchlings deck. Timeless reading, positivity, love, and light, seeking guidance, wisdom, protection. Please help me find answers for this, this spread right here, for this message. Please help me f clarify this message. We have four of wands and then ten of cups. Please help me clarify this message. Thank you, thank you. Please help me clarify this message, please. Thank you, thank you. Please help me clarify this message. Thank you, thank you. Time is reading people watching other than myself. Please help me clarify this message. Okay. So, t enthusiasm, prosperity. Okay, enthusiasm. Okay, okay. Now this is coming to me. Okay. 
Okay, so enthusiasm with this one. I'm feeling like you either have a lot a lot of road ahead of you. A lot of a lot of um drive, but a lot of <laughs> that's so funny. Road drive, no. Ambition. You have a lot of yeah, enthusiasm. You have a lot of work ahead of you. So you have four of wands, ten of cups. I feel like there's something that is being either neglected that you need to put in the forefront. Um, look, they're forgetting their child back here. So I don't know how, how I got this message, but your neglect, look, you have, you have your family, right? But then someone, something is being left behind, someone, someone. So, um, a needle in a haystack, I feel. And it's like, you don't know which way to go. I, like, you, this, like you, you don't know if you should go here. You can't see the sun shining through there. You don't know if you should go there. You can't see the sun shining through there. So, you either on this path and you're, like, not sure how to get to where you need to get to. You have enthusiasm, you have the energy for it, you just don't know where to go. She's following behind. So she sees the trees in front of her. She, trees in front of me, I see trees in front of me. But she's like, she looks like she's about to go this way. Not sure if she should go this way or she should follow her her parents and be behind them. I feel like there's some undecided undecisive energy. You have you have the enthusiasm to accomplish something. But I think there's a, a road that's not that you're not um you're not sure what road what what pathway to take, what you know, what crossroad to take. You're at the crossroads. You don't know which one to take. Left, right. So look, and this guy is happy. So maybe he's not sure. Oh, here's another one. He Maybe he's not sure if he should build his family. Maybe he doesn't want to have any more children. Maybe his partner does. She seems enthusiastic about building her family. She's like, yep, I'll deal with one more child. But I, I, the other partner does. I don't think the other partner does want to build the family. Maybe that's what I'm getting here. He's unhappy, but she's happy. So she probably has enthusiasm. She's probably like eager to build a family. Look, there could be a potential to have one more child. Perhaps, maybe this is your message, maybe not. This can be something else that we're forgetting. Maybe it's something, maybe you, I don't know. For right now, I'm gonna go with children, since there are a lot of them here in this picture. So you, someone, not wanting wanting another child. Maybe that it's already happening. Maybe someone in your, Maybe a partner or you're already pregnant and your partner doesn't want another f child because of the finances. Pro maybe they look prosperity. So maybe they're worried about you losing money or you guys never, you know, being able to move forward in your life and get the things that you've been dreaming about. Maybe this is going to be a setback. But I feel like, look, prosperity came out. I feel like your partner is worrying too much. You're going to make it. When there's, when there's a will, there's a way. So enthusiasm, prayer with prosperity. So either you're enthusiastic about building a family and about creating financial freedom for yourself as well. So let's read what these says. Life is always brighter when you wake up each day with the spirit of enthusiasm. Know that you deserve all things wondrous and believe you can have them. Oh. So you're probably wanting your cake and eat you want to you have your cake and eat it too. You want to have you want to build your family and you want to be prosperous. But your partner is probably like, I don't know how I'm supposed to make this work. I'm working crazy hours already. So you leaving the thought or someone leaving the thought of having another child behind, but it's like it's there already. So maybe you someone is pregnant. Or maybe you're like, try, you're really wanting to achieve pregnancy and your partner is like, nope, I'm closing up shop. 
little connect connections coming together. And this is like, do I, do I not? Do I want this child? Oh, wow, look at this. She's left behind. This cat is like right there, hiding. You don't even see it. And it's like, it's almost like you're looking this way and you don't see that something's right behind you. So, just like them. They're looking forward, they're not looking behind them. So maybe you wanna move forward with your life with what you have already, but either there's a child coming that ch a child a new child may come or I don't know if you're adopting and the paperwork finally coming through and maybe you're f you're changing your mind this is another message maybe you applied for adoption like two years ago and it's finally happening but at this time you already have maybe you already conceived the natural way and you're like having second thoughts you're like oh no no I already I already accomplished my goals ah. and maybe you forgot that you filed paperwork and now someone is needing a home and you're like oh Oh man, I, I, I can't, how, do I, how do I get myself out of this mess? I can't believe I didn't take care. So I don't know, I'm feeling like you, maybe you have your, your home is full and you, this, and one more is just gonna be too much for you to handle or your partner to handle. So what card, what deck do I go with? What deck do I go with? What deck? I'm gonna go with this deck. The Chicoli Oracle, Chicoli. All right, I time this reading. Please help me clarify this reading. So someone having a change of heart, someone leaving something behind, someone, some, somebody wanting to move forward and leave something behind because they can't take any more. They can't add any more to their plate. They just can't. Oh, one second. Hold on. Oh, what is this? All right. Come on, card. All right, this card came out. It was the, the, okay, doesn't have a word. So let's see. Any synchronicities here? Okay, the flooring kind of looks the same. The flooring kind of looks the same. Look at that, okay. Somewhat grayish patterns here. Okay. Okay, any more synchronicities? Whew, all right. So basically, um, this, okay. I'm so glad there's no word, no, there are no words because I can just go by my own intuition and figure out what my brain wants, to, wants me to tell you. Um, okay. Whew, okay, so this is telling me that you're, you, you're wanting to you're you're above you're I think you're you're done you're done with something and you want to rise above it you're done with this whole gameplay maybe you're done playing with toys you're done changing diapers for instance um you just want another path you know look you're like you feel tied down perhaps look you're part of the ch chess you're part of the chessboard and you're like you're blending in with the chessboard. Maybe you you feel like you're losing yourself because of all these game pieces in your life. Maybe all these children, or maybe this could be that you are maybe you are a boss, a supervisor. You have so many people underneath you. Um, I mean, you got emotions here. I don't know if this has to do with that, but we'll see. You know, this is a general reading. So you have maybe you you're leading so many people a queen, and you're like. You can't do it anymore. Maybe this is like you're you're done with this. You're done with the gameplay. You're done demanding or controlling people or bossing people around. Enthusiasm. Maybe you have fire to create something else for yourself. Prosperity. You work so hard. I feel like this prosperity against. I mean, uh, uh, against you. No. Uh, uh, ahead of you. Enthusiasm. Prosperity you creating a new path for yourself. Maybe you don't want to go this way or that way. Maybe you want to go this way or that way or this way. So um, I'm going to say that you are, you're pretty much, it's a wrap with whatever, um, whatever, uh, you know, situation you're in. I think you're wanting a change. Things are still too. There's nothing really happening. These things, these pieces are moving, but you're like still just watching, observing. And you probably have a drive to do something else with your life. Ten of Cups. Maybe you want a nice, happy home. 
you maybe you're done with something or you just want to come home and just live your life but something is look you're unhappy look at that sad face all right let's figure out what my crystal card wants to say i'm wrapping up this reading with something that i created myself i created myself oh okay thank you okay any synchronicities let's see okay oh a dress look at that all oh, these dresses kind of look the same look at that ruby dress witchly witchling dress they kind of look the same don't they a little bit anybody else wearing a dress she's wearing a nice gown okay let me stop okay so um ruby healing benefits holds leadership qualities <laughs> Oh my gosh, we already established that, didn't we? You're in the lead here. You're on your throne, crown. Okay, let's see. Uh, relief to health problems, help with depression, build self-confidence. What motivational speaker or leader do you find inspiring? Who's teaching, who teaching, whose teachings do you value and respect? Have you applied them to your life? So, I... That's something that I created. Um, that's just food for thought if you want to ponder that. You can share in the comments. Blue Quartz, self-discipline, enhances organizational abilities, communication, and chakras. What needs order in your life? What needs to be prioritized? Thank you. So you're needing control of your life again. Things are probably out of control. Look at that. They're fighting on your, on your board, your chessboard. Things are out of control. Look, parents are leaving their child behind. They're not keeping in mind. Keep, keeping their child in mind what's going on things are out of control you're you're all over the place you have enthusiasm maybe you're like you have all this energy but you don't know where to put it you don't know where to channel it or where to direct it get yourself a wand so what needs order in your life i think that's what you're needing things are probably a little chaotic for you they're not you're not maybe you're you're just tired of of the life you're living and you want a change she's tired She's sitting down on her throne. She's like, please, I need a change. I'm feeling drained. Look, her hands are like, please. So um, that's what I'm going to leave you with. Let me know if this makes sense. If not, then it doesn't. Um, what does this mean to you? What can you do? I think you need to change, change direction, find a new path for yourself. What is going to bring you prosperity? What is it? A new career, perhaps. A new path, perhaps. Go towards the lights. Go towards the door. She's like, I'm going this way. I don't know about you guys, but I'm taking off here. So find your own path. She's going to find her own uh, escape, her own exit. That's what you need to do. How can you ex ex escape so that you don't have to feel bogged down or um, depleted or unhappy? Do what you want to do for a change. What does that mean for you? Thank you for watching. You have a beautiful day. I am V. Take care. And don't forget to subscribe, share this video, and I'll catch you in the next one.